In this European Lung Cancer Congress, we presented the data of uh, interim analysis of the phase B3 trial evaluating the role of afatinib in patients with EGFR positive non small cell lung cancer. We reported the analysis based on the 479 patients treated with afatinib in first and second and third line setting. For patients that receive a fat in the first line setting, we overlap the results of the, the randomized clinical trial just published at the LAX LANG3 and the LAX LANG6. But we noted that for patients treated in second and third line setting, the survival was shorter. And this is very interesting because this trial showed the, uh, the importance of the data of a real world practice. For the same way, we noted that the patient with the uncommon mutation or ECOPS2 achieve a progression-free survival is only 6.0 months. And this is important because an alpha of the progression-free survival achieved in the overall portion population the randomized clinical trial. It's important for the future to focus on the uncommon mutation that is uh, um, very, very intriguing in the, uh, this, uh, the future um, is important because we have a two kinds of uncommon mutation, the sensitive uncommon mutation and the resistant common mutation. Uh, maybe at the last of the years we report in the data of a combined analysis of two different trials evaluating the role of a fatinib in uncommon mutation.